and action. <laughs> Hi there, I'm Jules Wheeler and you're watching Your Sport. Coming up in the show, we take an exclusive look behind the scenes at Wembley. What happens before a big match and who makes it happen? Now, me and Footy go back a long way and the whole gang here knows this. Did they let me go? Did they let me stand on the hallowed turf and drink in the atmosphere? Yes, of course they did. Take a look at this. I'm here at the North London Parachute Centre where I'm about to embark on a 13,500 foot skydive. It wouldn't be so bad except I'm terrified of heights. But I'm all registered in now so there's no turning back. Now, we know catwalk shows are glitzy affairs with invited guests clamouring for front row seats. Imagine all those egos bumping into each other. Well, last week I went to Paris Fashion Week and dived straight into the organised chaos. You'll love this. There was plenty of champagne too. I'm here in London outside the Juice Box Cosmetics flagship store in Conduit Street where this evening we have the Lipstick and Frock event taking place. I'm here with Harvey who is the owner and also the expert on Juice Box. Harvey, where did the name Juice Box come from? Well, creating a new brand of makeup, I knew I had to have something very unique and I knew it had to be in the name. And wanting something that was cool, something sexy, something really fun. And I just had to have something that was just had the spot. And G Spot just had that satisfaction behind it. There we have it from the man himself. G Spot, listen out for that one. I'm just a girl. Now, what do you know about extreme sports? Absolute madness or mind-blowing skill and bravery? Bungee jumping? Nah, that's old hat these days. I'm talking about cliff jumping or jungle trekking in Ecuador or even white water rafting in Nepal. I got on my quad bike and I went to find out just how you sign up. Here's how I got on. Hello and welcome to Penny Hill Park. Located within the heart of Surrey, this 19th century mansion house is set within a 120 acre estate. It boasts 123 rooms, two fabulous restaurants, an exquisite spa, and also has a wide range of activities which include golf and tennis. It's everything you could expect from a five-star hotel and more. Let's go and take a closer look. Arctic Monkeys took to the stage in New Zealand last night for their first gig in over a year. Performing some old favourites to a packed crowd in Wellington, they also treated their Kiwi fans to three new songs. They previewed the new tracks Dangerous Animals, Pretty Visitors and Crying Lightning to the sold-out audience in the city's town hall. Oh, 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 oh. 